Everything around us is made of atoms. Based on arrangement of atoms, things are characterized into solid, liquid and gas. In solids, atoms are closely packed with no relative movement and in liquid, they are loosely packed with limited relative movement. But in case of gas, atoms are free to move around. Because of free movement, particles of gas are scattered and are not visible to naked eyes. For example, you can see vapor coming out of boiling water near the pot but it becomes invisible after some distance as particles start scattering. Air behaves similar to gas. In air, particles are free to move around and because of this, air occupies all the space above the land. We call this occupied space, atmosphere. Air is denser near the land and as we move further upward, amount of air decreases. Why is air denser near the land? If you throw something up, it comes down after some time because of pull force of earth. Similar principle applies to air particles. They too move under this pull force. Because of random free movement, air particles spread till some distance above the land. Based on amount and type of air, our atmosphere is divided into six layers. Troposphere Stratosphere Mesosphere Thermosphere Ionosphere Exosphere Troposphere has very dense air whereas exosphere has very less amount of air. Place after exosphere is called space. Space has no air, 